people ask, where do you get your ideas? Well, right here. All of this is my Martian landscape. Somewhere in this room is an African veldt. Just beyond, perhaps, is a small Illinois town where I grew up. And I'm surrounded on every side by my magician's toy shop. I'll never starve here. I just look around, find what I need, and begin. I'm Ray Bradbury. And this is... Well then, right now, what shall it be? Out of all this, what do I choose to make a story? I never know where the next one will take me. And the trip? Exactly one half exhilaration, exactly one half terror. Surgery, Dr. Douglas? Yes. Ready? Yeah. Foul fiend dig that! Oh! Oh! It only hurts when I laugh. <laughs> oh, I'm going to miss you and your jokes. Do you think your parents would let me keep you? Oh, Dougie. Mm. <laughs> stomach. Operation almost completed. Dougie, could you see what they want? Okay, Grandma, sure. Bonjour, mon petit. I don't speak French. Good afternoon. Uh, is the owner She's here? She's busy. Well, I wish to rent a room. They're all rented. We're full. Sorry. Douglas. Come in, sir. Come in. Douglas, make yourself useful. Show Mr... Uh, Mr... Coberman. Uh, show Mr. Coberman to room 12. Cober. What kind of name is Cober? Thank you, madam. Well, I shall rest a little before dinner.
is at 6.30 sharp, and if you're late coming down, the soup will get cold. Grandma fixes it, so it will. Thank you. Douglas, Monsieur Dumas, dinner in 15 minutes. J'arrive. Supper. Well, sounds like our new guest is awake. While everybody here sleeps forever, more vanishing young women, Molly is dead. Another last night, found her this morning, white like snow, not a drop of blood left in her. Monsieur Dumas, fold up that paper and roll up your tongue. Yes. No death talk, please. No murders while we eat. Young ladies like you, should be extra careful, Miss Treadwell. Couldn't hurt. Why? Nothing could ever happen to little me, could it? No. Oh, Mr. Coverman, good evening. Yes, it is. Um, this is uh, Monsieur Dumas. The world's greatest artist. Oh, and bookseller. <laughs> I am Madame Marguerite. Greatest grandma. And this is uh, Emmy Treadwell. Greatest student ever. And you, sir? Greatest what? Uh, well, I am the greatest uh, traveler in the world. Oh, well, no. <laughs> That must be fascinating. And the reason for your travels? Business, pleasure? A little of both, but uh, mostly pleasure. Enough questions. Let Mr. Koberman eat his dinner. Jimmy, I forgot your silverware. Oh, don't worry, madam. I brought my own. Boy, wooden knife, wooden fork, wooden spoon. You carved them yourself? Uh, harmless eccentricity. Help yourself, Monsieur Dumas. You too, Miss Treadwell, please. Help yourself, Mr. Coberman. Uh, sound of silver breaks uh, threads all through my system. By the way, madam, there will be no need for you to prepare me a noon meal. My hours are uh, irregular and I rarely eat during the day. As you wish, Mr. Coberman. Should you change no. your mind? No. Thank you, madam. Want to see my magic trick?
Mr. Copperman, your name, is it Czech? Hungarian. Excuse me. I... I am no longer uh, hungry. Thank you. Good evening. Uh, good evening. Uh, Douglas, what did you do? Yeah, what did I? <laughs> 